Hello YouTube and today I wanted to go over a small little business idea uh, for just a hundred dollars and your gas and your time. Um, you can go to the local bank and you can start up coin collecting of course and my recommendation is to start with uh, 50 cents or pieces or uh, going with quarters uh, just as you know they're a larger denomination uh, easier to go through. And of course, if you're looking at pennies or something like that, you're just going to have like a lot of different um, uh, coins you're going to be going through comparatively. Although pennies can pay, pennies can't pay. So I just wanted to share, of course, my find today as well. Um, and then we're going to go over the logistics in another video as far as uh, how to start up your own small little business, uh, you know, or hobby or whatever. Um, with just a hundred dollars, which you can end up turning into, uh, potentially $200 over a period of time. And then slowly, of course, grow, uh, a legitimate amount of money, of course. So, so here's my find right now. Uh, basically I had a hundred dollars. I went with, uh, to the bank and I got some 1976s, uh, our bicentennials, two rolls. Uh, so of course they were circulated, uh, or all these are circulated coins, most likely, of course, uh, the 76s were um, just, I guess, put in there by a collector and decided to go get some money from the local bank, of course, that's usually how it goes. And then, of course, I found, uh, as you can see in this open roll, you probably see a sneak peek, a 1979, uh, 69, I'm sorry. Uh, another 1969, uh, 1968, uh, another 68, and another 68, uh, 66, which I think looks pretty darn good. Um, I don't know if it's good enough for grading, of course, we can see on the video. Um, then we have a 67 and a 68. And then over here, these are the ones that I thought were... Um, well, this one right here, the 68, uh, I thought was a little bit rough, but this, uh, 67 right here, I thought might be, and in your opinion, you can leave some comments if you're of course a coin collector or, uh, decide to, of course, start collecting coins, uh, your opinion, of course, uh, if this right here is a good enough coin to get graded. And if I did get it graded, of course, would I probably be able to get that 65, that Mint State 65 from this? And just from the sheer uh, lighting and everything else on it, you might not be able to tell. You'd probably have to see it face up. Uh, there are some smudges. Um, but uh, as far as I would like to know from the community, if you are a coin collector, uh, what this might actually fare. Because I don't really want to. I am going to send some of my personal coins in to get uh, graded. Uh, but I would like to know before I get graded uh, what this might fare in your opinion. You can leave that comment and like and subscribe uh, if you would like to see further video content as far as this goes. Uh, my goal, of course, is to get to 1,000 subscribers. So I've been doing a little bit of everything as far as chess, as far as gaming, uh, and... You know, I haven't brought a Mega Man X dive uh, video in a while, but I might bring that up soon. And yeah, there you have it. Thanks so much for viewing. Uh, I hope you enjoyed. And if you would like to see uh, more silver stacking slash, which I'm going to coin this or hashtag this as silver stacking because I lucked up and found some silver, um, then go ahead and like and subscribe and uh, go ahead and uh, leave some comments, of course, if you care. Thanks so much for viewing.